So, you have just picked up the PS5, and you want to hook it up to a great monitor to be wowed by all the impressive visuals, but, you have only got a 5-year-old monitor. Well, you came to the right place because here you'll find the best monitor for PS5 consoles, whether you're in the market for the best PS5 monitor money can buy. Samsung 27-inch 240Hz Curved Monitor. On a tight budget? Don't panic. Because it's actually possible to bag a high refresh 1080p monitor with a curved premium panel from one of the biggest brands in the business. And all for under $300. We give you the Samsung in 27-inch. The highlights start with a 27-inch curved VI panel. It's not HDR compliant. But thanks to the 3001 contrast, it's actually capable of more dynamic range than many monitors that claim HDR capabilities. It also sports a 1800R curve for added immersion. Predictably, at this price point, we're talking 1080p rather than 4K. But then if you want that super smooth high refresh experience, you're not going to get it at 4K likewise, at 27 inches this is hardly a huger cinematic screen. But, once again, something has to give to hit this level of affordability. As a gaming-focused monitor, it has several additional gaming-friendly features including low input lag mode. If there is a catch, it's probably pixel response. Samsung quotes 4 milliseconds, which isn't too shabby. However, that's a great a great time, and this is a VI panel, so expectations in terms of pixel speed probably need to be kept in check. BenQ 28-inch 4K monitor. You have just dropped $400 plus on your PS5, and your monitor budget is looking a little tight, so you are looking for the best budget PS5 monitor that also has 4K capabilities. The BenQ should be your one and only option. It sports excellent clarity, and due to its TN panel nature, also has varying degrees of brightness and contrast. Additionally, with an input lag of 1 millisecond, you're going to experience instantaneous response time, probably upping your chances of winning those 1v1 gunfights. Worried about the effect on your eyes? The BenQ not only has low blue light technology, it also has zero flicker, keeping your eyes feeling fresher for longer. This will aim to reduce your headaches after incredibly lengthy gaming sessions, and probably increase the longevity of the screen too, not being so bright constantly. So, what's the catch? Well, there are no real downsides to picking up this budget PS5 monitor, apart from the fact its refresh rate maxes out at 60Hz, this means you won't be able to experience those 120fps, but, with 4K resolution in its place, you'll probably opt for the crispness over frames per second anyway. ViewSonic VX2768 the 27-inch panel sports a tight 1500R curve for that immersive wraparound feel and is based on VI technology. The implications of VI tech include outstanding static contrast of 3001, plus punchy colors and good viewing angles. VI technology used to suffer from poor pixel response. But the latest generation of panels is much improved. Consequently, ViewSonic reckons the VX2768 is good for 1 millisecond response times. The kicker, of course, and the key enabler of high frame rates, is the 1920 by 1080 as opposed to 4K native resolution. It is a significant step down versus 4K when it comes to detail and sharpness. But 1080p is still 2 million pixels, and for fast-paced games, the improved response and buttery smooth frame rates are arguably more important than the pixel count. You don't get HDR support either. But then true HDR was never going to be available at this ultra-aggressive price point. In short, this monitor represents an awful lot of high refresh fun for the money and makes a neat underrated PS5 monitor contender. Acer Nitro VG270K a massive widescreen display among its contemporaries, Acer's Nitro VG270K utilizes AMD Radeon FreeSync technology to take advantage of the highest resolutions available. While the monitor comes with a default refresh rate of 60Hz, your graphics card will dictate the refresh rate. If you have a high-end graphics card like the NVIDIA 2080 RTI, it'll work very smoothly with this monitor, since there's no on-screen tearing. Some other goodies integrated with this include dual 2-watt speakers mounted at the monitor base and other technologies to provide a visual feast. The speakers are good enough for the type of sound quality they provide. 
The monitor is made predominantly of plastic all around the surface, minus the display itself. It's Acer's standard practice since they tend to cut corners in their manufacturing process before commercial release. Overall, this is still a decent monitor equipped with some of the most current technologies that get the job done, and a good solution if you want a monitor to play the PS5 on a fairly large screen with excellent visuals. Alienware 25 Gaming Monitor One of the most popular names within the gaming tech world, Alienware has repeatedly released hardware that is both uniquely designed and powerful. The Alienware 25 is no exception, offering 25 inches of 1920 by 1080 screen real estate in a sleek and futuristic form factor. Although notable for its looks, it offers all of the high-end specs you'd come to expect with a top-tier console gaming monitor. Featuring a maximum refresh rate of 240Hz, it has a 1 millisecond response time for snappy and crisp gaming, with virtually zero image lag. Additionally, the inclusion of AMD FreeSync will smooth out PC gaming for minimal image tearing and artifacts. While the monitor may have a large footprint, taking up considerable space on a desk, the thin bezel makes it a great option for a multiple monitor setup for those who can accommodate it. With the addition of six visual setting profiles, three of which you'll be able to fully customize, you'll be able to effortlessly switch between them on the fly between games. Other built-in features include an on-screen timer and FPS counter, allowing for easy tracking of both in-game features and PC performance. Alright guys that's all for now.